The city of Jacksonville's website for those applying for financial aid to pay rent and utility bills is up and functioning again. It crashed earlier today. A total of $3 million is available for Duval County families who are struggling economically due to the COVID-19 pandemic. News for Jack reporter Brianna Andrews is joining us live. Brianna, we heard from people who said they waited at least an hour trying to apply for some of this money. Tom, I spoke with a young woman who says she had all of her documents ready at 745 this morning. She says when the website started glitching, she didn't know what to do. From rising rent costs to record-breaking inflation, 20-year-old single mother Kalia Clemens feels like she can't catch a break. I mean, daycare's gone up, um, after-school care, groceries have gone up tremendously, gas. Um, so it's like, and then what well, wages aren't going up, so we have to find other things to compensate for the large increase that we're having with literally everything. In hopes to get some financial relief, Kalia woke up bright and early with the intention of becoming one of the first people to apply for the city of Jacksonville's emergency rental assistance program. She says when she got to the last part of the portion, the website stopped working. It was stuck on a loading screen. What was going through your head at that moment? I was like, did I miss something? Uh, what's going on? Did the website crash? Um, am I going to get through on time? Like, what's going on? I'm like panicking. I'm on my phone, on my laptop. I'm trying everything. Two hours later, she was finally able to submit her application. The city of Jacksonville says it'll take about two weeks to process the application and money will be dispersed based on priority. Priority will be given to those families that have incomes at 50 percent um, or below the area median income have at least one or more members in their household who have been unemployed for at least 90 days or have a pending ev eviction. And the last day to apply for the program is December 5th. We have a list of additional information, including the requirements needed to apply to the program on our website, newsforjax.com. For now, though, reporting live in downtown Jacksonville, Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, The Local Station.